welcome to Lunacy Saints Roads, a psychological horror game, I do believe. Let's just get into it. The bam. The demo contain oh, demo. The demo contains frightening scenes, flashing lights, and demon names. Sure. There's one gripe I'm gonna have about this game, and I'm gonna let you guys know what happened. One I downloaded the game on itch.io uh on the sixth of July. And then when I went to it today, the developer for this game actually added a cost, added a fee to this game. And honestly, I incidentally bought the game uh, after having already downloaded it for free. So one, I'm kind of pissed off because it was free. I had downloaded it to play it. And then he added 299 euros or 299 pounds to the game. And it's a fucking demo. So unless the payment was for a full game, and it's not a scam, or it's not going to be vaporware, I basically paid for a game I already freely downloaded. Um, and why a developer to this would add money after having launched the game originally for free is very sketchy. And I basically wasted $4.50 Canadian if the money uh, doesn't go towards also paying the full game if those this actually goes somewhere. Because if it's just like, I downloaded a free demo, and that's it, and then like the full game later on, the developer will be like, here's the full game, since you bought the demo, you can have the full game down the road. Then okay, I won't complain as much. But I paid for a demo that I already had gotten for free. That bugs me. It really bugs me. With that said and done, and that uh, gripe and irritation out of the way, I'm going to actually play the game now. Bam! Loud lightning. A little bit of a slowness in this game. No flashlight. Let's just explore a little bit. Is door openable? No! Coming upstairs. Definitely not giant creepy paintings. It's too fucking dark to really see anything. I can't see fucking shit. This is like a family photo or something. Actually, I swear I said something about a flashlight, maybe at the main menu. F is flashlight, crouch is control, right mouse button to zoom while inspecting. Okay. So I don't have a flashlight yet. I can't read this shit. Well, maybe, maybe I can. No, no, I can't. I can't. Um. Oh, that's a dream. So. Step number one, I have to find a fucking flashlight. Unless it's like around here somewhere. Now that's another photo. Jeez. It's stuck. I hope there's a flashlight at least like on this fucking table I just missed. There is! Hello! I'll take that. Beautiful. A little unoptimized, but hey, sweetie, just to let you know, I won't be coming home to the, uh, till the midnight. If you come home earlier, please leave the lights on and go to sleep as soon as you can, love mom. Aw, oh, thanks, mom. The lights aren't fucking working. Hmm. Not the loud lightning. Not working. Oh, it can open these, too. That's cool. I like interactability. Crouch. I can't open cupboards. I can only open a certain amount of drawers, too. What's this? It looks important, but I can't touch it. Alright. Sure. I guess we can now go upstairs since I can see now. What the fuck kind of painting is this? Like, is it, like, who would have a house like this? This isn't a mother's house. This is like a grandmother's house. A door. Hmm. <laughs> Thought I heard footsteps. Another little fucking notepad thing. Uh -huh. Another one. I got a feeling I'm gonna be dying to some kind of ghost at some point. Let's see, it's 
It's not the. It's not well optimized. It's just my graphics card is extremely shit. Oh, hello. Two evil twins, surrounded by three mannequins. Sure. Mm, a he in form of a cross. Oh, never mind, that's reversed. There we go. Um, what's that supposed to mean? That the key's at someone's grave? That's at least what I think it means. Oh, here we go, the first openable door! No jump scares, please. That would suck. Also, I can read this now, and there's a key there. November 18th, 1904. We timely, we, we timely, found a place to live. It's a little town called St. Rose. In the city of Angel Falls. Despite the things that happened in that house, we got a great offer and we knew we had to take it. We knew that the town was abandoned. We had no problem with it. The house is very old but spacious and has a beautiful view on the church and the forest. I don't know how viewing a church from your house is beautiful, but that's just me. I ain't the religious type. Especially if it's an old house like this that they say is actually abandoned. Kind of fucking foxes from Amazon. Apparently, I can close the door. I feel a little more secure if it's closed. Unless I have to run, then I'm not gonna feel secure. Leave the lights on, she said. And the lights don't work. I'll still flip it up in case the up is uh, light on. That, that plate is about to fall, also. No! Seriously! That's annoying. Who the fuck is, like, pranking this goddamn house in the middle of the night? Or someone's like entered the house after ringing the doorbell 50 billion times to let me know that they were coming in. Um. Fuck. Oh, pages without covers? That's interesting. But okay, um. I grabbed a key. Was it to this room then? Or was it to another room? I guess since the doorbell rang, I had to check it out. Hello? Open again. Hello? No. Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. Oh no, a shadow! That phone's gonna be ringing at some point, ain't it? So a person's outside and he's pranking me. It might be a social experiment, depending if they have a camera crew or not. But uh let me see, is there a No, there's no inventory. Okie dokie. Back. So what am I missing? door opened. Okay. I'll just walk in here, I guess. Oh no! An upside-down pagan symbol. Where's the light switch? Uh, okay, well, I don't know why this is here, but, uh... Yeah. Nothing. Really? Oh, the key was for this door. Hello? Just another bedroom. We'll go into that room after. Also, why is this why is this table so tall? Hello, hello. 
January! I found a door hidden behind the cabinet in our room. After searching the whole damn place, I found the key on the top shelf in one of the teacups. Teacups. I hesitated going inside for a while. I thought she might be there. Finally entered and I saw a something full of presents. I locked the door and hid the key behind the something. Ah, useful. So, teacups and on the top of something something. Um, I don't know. Like, we'll just have to investigate slowly and find out what the fuck they were talking about. Behind a wardrobe. Hello. Why can't I open you? Maybe something's dead and will come out of there. Oh. I haven't explored this room yet, so there should be something here. Oh, great newspaper. St. Rhodes Murder! John Miller, Project 2, found dead in his house by a little girl. By a little girl. Near the city of Angel Falls. He found the floor covered in his own blood with a cross in his hand, pentagram carved on his stomach. Along the name Samagenia? Sem 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 Samagina? What? Samagina? Samagina? Most horrifying murder in the last 20 years! The place must be pretty far. St. Rose completely abandoned. Sure. Oh, wait, great. Slender Man. Original. And my flashlight being garbage is also quite original. My biggest question is why there's so many boxes littered around the place? Another note. She is gone. I can't believe she's gone. I searched the whole house many times and still nothing. That's the stupid business trip. I should have stayed with her those few days before our wedding. I just don't understand where could she be and why the wedding dress? Why is it the only thing missing? What was she trying to do? Be, you know, be a bride? I don't know. Hello, hello, teacup. Which one? This one? This one? No. Up. I can't reach that high up. I'll need a chair. You. I'm suspecting I'll push this, but there's no... Oh, wait, hey, blood. 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 Hello? I heard a little door. Open noise. Okay. Ah, uh, back to investigating. This stool ain't fucking moving, even though I think it's gonna be needed. God damn it! I thought I heard footsteps. That scared me. No, legit scared me. I'm a little jumpy. They swear I hear footsteps. Like, not anymore. Unless it's like outside grass stepping footsteps, but it sounds like it's footsteps on the rug. And since I'm on one, it makes me nervous that something's behind me. Also, well, is that more blood? It's like this is where the body was under the rug? Because it's not, if not for that, then there's a rug under a rug. Oh, hi. What? Um. Okay, time to just move, I guess. Jesus. Um, what? Oh, hi. You're glitching towards me, buddy. Uh, do I need to flash you a bit? Uh, oh, this isn't, this isn't good. Ah, uh, this ain't no good. We survived! That's good. The light's turned on. Did they? Did it? Or he... I have no idea. But apparently he showed up and apparently she just got Oh Oh, light switch. I'll activate you. It feels like lights turned on. But what light? That is definitely not on. Oh, you. Okay. 
Kind of have to turn on more lights then. Because I think it doesn't like the light. He might think he's going to be showing up at some other point, and this light will be what kills him. Maybe the only thing that made it so he stopped chasing me was a thunder uh, flicker of light. I'm going to leave it here, though. So before I get too far into it and the video becomes too long, but it is so far a, a pretty decent tense game. It's a demo still. I still have my complaints of the developer making it so it costs money rather than being free. And unexpectedly, like, one or two days after releasing it on uh, Edge.io. So what I'm, like, afraid is that the developer saw, oh, hey, a bunch of people are downloading it. Well, I'm going to just add money so I can profit off of it. But, of course, there is also the side, of course. The developer has claimed that the game has been seven months in creation, so it's all... it's... it's, um... It's normal also for a developer, obviously, who put seven months of time off and on in a game and want some kind of profit off of it. So it's not like I'm arguing against that, but the whole was free is a demo cost 299 euros was free and it's still a demo but that's my argument for there outside of that i'm going to continue playing and beat this demo and hope a full game of it comes out so i didn't waste my fucking money and i hope you enjoyed the series as we continue along so hope you enjoyed if you did please leave a like comment hit that subscribe button become a plus subscriber and also hit that bell down below to get notifications when i release more videos and until the next time that was super close Open faster. Open faster. Now open faster! Oh, uh oh. Oh yeah, fuck you. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Okay, the bitch is dead. <laughs>